but before yesterday and i feel like it's too long it looks a little matronly it's not giving hot girl do, 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 do. they not let like good they not let like good they not let like good i like the beat <laughs> but what is he saying hey you guys what is up and welcome back to another vlog welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome if you're not new thank you for sticking by your girl for rocking with me once again we in the car this is just probably gonna be my signature starting vlogs in the car <laughs> or being vlogs being in the car because it's a habit now but today is Monday Memorial Day and we're having a little barbecue so I'm headed to Walmart to pick up some last minute things so we need some more ice we need um, a foil pan inflatables with a little kiddie pools stuff like that today is said it's gonna be hot the high is said to be 99 degrees child they're trying to kill your breath they're trying to kill y'all's favorite breath and right now the car says it's 90 degrees but my watch said it's 92 they're trying to kill me but anyway I'm gonna go pick up these things from Wally World. And come back home. So I'll catch you guys later. And I'm gonna show you guys some of the setup and the food and all that stuff. Cause Bay is on the grill. So today should be a good day. Um, Mom had bought these two inflatable pools. One for one for baby girl, so they're gonna be splash a lashing in the pool. So today's gonna be a good day. So, ooh, that's a vintage. Nice. Anyway, I'll catch you guys when I get to Walmart. You guys what is up good morning it's in store at sephora oh well, i forgot i was watching well listening to Aliyah's face her latest vloggy vlog well good morning guys i am headed out and about well hopefully my gps would work because i was in a zone oh i forgot my ring at home because I, I take it off now because my hands be randomly swelling and I don't know what that's about. So I just usually take it off. But we are headed out and about. It's a new day. It's the morning time. It's 9.25 a.m. I have a meeting in about 5 minutes and it'll take me 30 minutes to get to my destination. Yes, it's one of those days. So I'm just gonna take the meeting on my phone. So yeah, I am in a very good mood today. Tired, but in a good mood. The vlog, this vlog may seem lackluster because I just been like spending a lot of time with my family into like Memorial Day and stuff. We had our barbecue. I showed you guys that footage. And I think I spoke to you guys Tuesday so today's Thursday so yeah days have passed yesterday we went to Vineland at premium outlets and we we have to figure out where I'm going okay cool okay we went to 
Vineland Premium Outlets to buy a bag for someone. So we went ahead and we did that. Um, it was me, Hubs, and Baby Girl. So it was a nice little outing. I also saw on like TikTok that at Disney Springs they do this drone show and they're going to be doing it up until I think September 2nd I said. It said, oh lord, I forgot my sunglasses and the sun is sunny, okay? But yeah, they do a drone show so I think one day we're going to go and see that. So me, hopes my brother, baby girl and mama, we may like, invite other people too but I don't know but that's the core group <laughs> who usually does stuff who's usually down for my shenanigans so yeah tomorrow we're gonna go on a little ice cream outing back to chilling because i really like their ice cream and it's like a really cool vibe it's new i have showed you guys um, or we may do that this afternoon Either this evening or tomorrow, we're we'll gonna go chilling and get some ice cream because I be wanting ice cream. And I mean, there's ice cream in our fridge, but I don't want that ice cream. I don't want ice cream, ice cream. So I've been. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned this like in the other. I think I did. I think I did in the other last week's vlog, but I did complete the Nike one club challenge so if anybody is interested in like joining a run club challenge with me i'm gonna do another one just let me know if you want to join since popo is in this area girl we are we gone and not here no more so i'm gonna do another challenge and i think i'm gonna push it to probably like I'm back 
talk for a little couple of minutes because my meeting finished early and it would be like a 15 minute meeting instead of a half an hour just closing out some stuff anyway um and i have a next meeting at 10 but i was saying before that i don't really eat junk food i would have like a burger from culver's every now and again but i love me some food so i would make me a burger at home i would eat thing on when i'm at home like home cooked food my mama kicked around in the kitchen so that's why the chicken been doubling but i'm gonna work on that I'm gonna start to try to eat better and incorporate like more of a balanced meal because i would make me a burger and fries at home and my real problem i feel is my sweet tooth i have like horrible cravings for sweets and I think it's due to my birth control because that's one when I read it it was like yeah, it could increase when I read a part it could increase like my sweet tooth so I be eating cookies and damn and cookies is like my only guilty pleasure but I would eat cookies until they're done like I'm not gonna just take one or two I'm gonna take three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten until they done, and that is the problem. <laughs> that is the problem. So, and my thing is, I don't really eat a lot during the day, but I will eat cookies. So, no food, just cookies and coffee. I would literally go all day without eating any food once I had my coffee and a, and some cookies. Good to go to go and I gotta stop that so I am working on that that is why I've been putting on I haven't been active and I've just been eating sweets like cookies because I don't eat junk food like I can do a what I eat in a week and junk food is not on the list it is not like I don't eat junk food I don't eat Chick-fil-A. I don't probably sometime this week was like the first time in like forever. I ate Chick-fil-A and that was breakfast. So it was uh, egg, bacon, and hash brown wrap. I don't eat Chick-fil-A. I don't eat McDonald's. I don't eat Wendy's. I don't eat like I don't eat junk food. Like I said, every now and again. I would have a cold ass burger, but I can't tell you the last time I had a burger from Colors. So it's the sweets is the problem. And working on it. Anyway, that was really all. Like I said, before, I have another meeting at 10. It's 9.50 now, so I'm gonna mentally prepare for that meeting. So I'll catch you guys later. Hey you guys, what is up? It is Friday. <laughs> I think I spoke to you guys yesterday, so I'm not doing too bad. But before yesterday, I said we were going for ice cream yesterday. We we're actually going to do it today. I actually totally forgot. So when I got up this morning and I remembered, I made sure to send everybody that I'm inviting a calendar invite. Let me ask Auntie Diadem if they want to go too. But I got me a little bunch of clothes because the Hot Girl Summer Tour is coming up. Before I show you guys that, I got two more pieces from the Future Collective Collection with our, our girl Janae Naylor. So I got the corset jean top because they had restocked it and I have seen... Jamima put it on. I was like, mm, I need that. I'm gonna need that. And yeah, so two pieces and then the matching denim skirt. Because I've been seeing people wear it and it looks so cute. It looks like it's a dress when they wear them both together. So yeah, I'm gonna do that. And I already tried these on. So it looks good. I also, okay, 
So to wear to the Hot Girl Summer Tour, Hubs already got his clothes, his outfits done packed. He was like, are we matching? And I was like, I don't think so, because I ordered a black, a black outfit and a red outfit. A black and gold outfit and a red outfit. And he ordered blush pink because they match his shoes. But anyway, so the first option we have here is this bodysuit is like one of those illusion bodysuits and then I wanted to wear this skirt with it but this skirt is giving nothing it's not giving what I thought it was gonna give with this and I feel like it's too long it looks a little matronly it's not giving hot girl because Look at how long this is. It's too long. It's too long. So, I'm going to go on Fashion Nova and see if they have any, like, probably like a pleated one or something like that. Or even like pants or shorts. And then I got this crop top that says Cherry Bomb. So it's a white crop top to go with these leather shorts that are red oh and then with this outfit I would wear these sunglasses even though it's in a nice time it's a concert so doesn't really matter the time of day and then with the black and gold I have gotten these sunglasses to wear with them it's like gold and brown and black <laughs> and then I just this chair is squeaking because your girl is wearing it low. Oh, I have to get my BC. That's what I got up for and I forgot. And then I just threw in these two shirts. I may even go with one of these shorts with whatever black pants or skirt. I find if I don't want to do form fitting because y'all know I still got my post baby body. And I'm not the most comfortable in it, but we trying to work with what we got. And anyway, I got this shirt where it's like, she's holding up her titties. She'll be holding up my titties. So I got that. And then I also got, cause I'm trying to do the whole, I don't, I'm not trying to be sexy, but like sexy illusion, you know, kind of way. And I got this shirt where it's like a graphic tee where it's kind of like her boobies out and it lines up perfectly with where my boobies are. So it makes it seem like, you know, it gives that kind of like sexy illusion. So those are the two extra tops. I'm going to go on Fashion Nova now and see what bottoms I can find. Or if I decide to go with the red set, I've seen some red shoes and a red bag that I want to get. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to do now. And go take my BC. So, I'm going to do that first before I forget because we need no more babies. We need no more babies. So, sorry about it. So, yeah. Anyway, catch you guys later. First of all, I hope jump scare. <laughs> But good morning. It is Saturday morning. I'm doing some skincare, as you can see, because my skin really needs it. This is the Fenty Skin Cookies and Clean Mask. I also have my coffee. The best part of waking up is folders in your cup. Period. But yeah, good morning, good morning, good morning. I was supposed to schedule to get a facial at Ulta today I was thinking like I told you guys previously about doing the dermatological facial that they have but I forgot to book it what I did not forget to do though is get some more pieces from oh that's the timer for my mask get some more pieces from the Janae Naylor and Target collection some more stuff came back into stock so I picked up I think three Three more things but yeah got some more of those things I got the um black 
It should be here on June 3rd. Is it June 3rd? Which is Monday? Because Target has like two day shipping. So this they may be in the next vlog. Let me see. Wait, are they still in my cart, girl? Oh, there's something else. No, it said June 6th. Why that is June 3rd? So one thing said it will, will be here on June 5th and the two other things on June 6th. So why don't be here June 3rd? I don't know. Anyway, so I got the um black version to the orange halter because that came back in stock and that could look really good with the jeans. And then I got, or even with this, the black version, all three of the things I got was black. So like the black version to the mini skirt. So got this, the black version to the white skirt. And the black version to the halter, like I said. So I got this. And then lastly, I think it's a black version to the shorts. Yeah. Lastly, I got the black version to the shorts. I think the shorts have silver detailing. Whereas the white one has black detailing. And I can wear... I hope I wasn't rubbing up on this mic the whole time. I can wear the black shorts with the black top. And it's a black shorts. I can wear it with anything. So yeah. I pick up those other three things from the collection. If you weren't able to pick up anything from the collection. People are returning stuff every day. <laughs> so, and they did a restock recently. I think because all everything was sold out from the collection chat. So everything. So they do restocks. Follow Janae Naylor on Instagram and you'll see what's restocking and what's not restocking. I think one of the things that's not restocking that I had my eyes on was the denim dress. Now I saw the denim dress in the Target that I went to when I showed you guys. But that, I don't think it would have fit my bust. It would have fit the rest of me. But my bust, especially when they full of milk child, they get. So I had to size up from that size that was there. And it was completely sold out online. So. Couldn't get it. Couldn't get her. But I think that was the only other thing that I would have wanted from the collection. That I didn't get. Anything else I was able to get. If you guys want a video with like all the pieces I got, and it's kind of late now because the collection maybe I already sold out. But if you guys just want to see what I got, like cohesively, because I know I should show you guys piece, 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 piece in like a span of what three different vlogs, <laughs> then let me know. If not, then I'm not gonna do it. But anyway. What do I have planned for today? Nothing much. Um, some cleaning. And that's basically it. I was thinking about going to the store. Like going in Target. Because when I go in Target sometimes, I find some really good pickups. Like the last time when I found the blazer that I can wear. Really like casually or even to work. So, I don't know. We'll see. I'm kind of tired of spending money, yeah. <laughs> Cause I be spending, spending, spending money like I got on these suits. Which I'm kind of tired. But yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Let me go wash this mask off my face and do something before something does me. You know what I mean? The devil makes work for idle hands. So do something. <laughs> do, 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 do. They not like good. They not like good. They not like good. Do 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 
So, for the song, Million Dollar Baby, right? I know I haven't seen a thing. That's literally why it'd be him when he's singing. Million Dollar Baby. But I what and million dollar baby? What are the words? <laughs> what a call! I be struggling to try to understand what he's saying. Like it's a nice song, good bop. You know, I like the beat. <laughs> but what is he saying? I never had a tattoo. Million dollar baby. Washing your face is not as glamorous as it looks on the commercials. When I wash my face, water gets everywhere. 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 So I always wipe down my countertops when I'm finished. Okay, so what face stuff do I want to put on? Let's find out. Gonna go ahead and use this Cos RX, the six peptide skin booster that I received. I use this basically daily. I don't know what it does. I think it's like an enhancer for like the serums and stuff you put on your face. But the instructions basically say to put on a lot. <laughs> so I just into my hair and then I rub it on my face. I put on a lot. Sometimes even going with like two layers of it when I'm feeling frisky. <laughs> but today we're gonna just do one. Because like the instructions say okay direction after washing your face take an adequate amount of this product in the first step of skincare and softly spread on the face. Pat it in, pat it softly to aid in absorption and apply multiple layers to deliver abundant efficacy to the skin. So I said I was just going in with one, but two won't hurt. Okay. I feel too that this helps with the hydration of my skin as well. Like my skin be hydrated, not oily. I mean, I have oily skin, but Keeping it hydrated. My skin produces oil because, well, I feel like everybody's skin produces oil because it needs moisture, I think. I think that's what I heard a dermatologist say, but people be saying it on social media, so. But yeah. So it produces the oil when it needs moisture, so. By putting on moisture, it probably wouldn't produce as much oil, child. I don't know. But yeah, that was the 6 Peptide Skin Booster by Coast RX. I give this a 9 out of 10. Because I feel like it's doing stuff. I mean, I don't have bad skin. Like, get into it. I get a, like, breakout every now and again on my chin. And then I had one right here for some reason. I don't know. But I don't have acne prone skin and stuff like that. So I'm just doing skincare to maintain my skin, not to fix anything. So I feel like any skincare really, unless it breaks me out, then we have a problem. But I feel like any skincare works for my skin. Because like I said, I don't have acne prone skin or like anything. Only thing I want is to get rid of some dark marks, but you can't really, really see them unless you're really close to my skin because melanated goddess, but I see them, you know what I mean? Like, it's the same thing like when I put on braces, people are like, oh, you didn't need braces. My bottom one was crooked and I saw it every day and I wanted to fix it and I could afford to fix it, so I fixed it. Anyway. That's a whole nother story. I'm not a storyteller. <laughs> Word to Lil Wayne. But, yeah. So my skin feels plump right now. So like I said, this is supposed to be based off the directions, the first step. So what else am I going to put on? I think I'm going to do 
Should I do my grow recipe stuff? Or should I do my affordable stuff? Hmm. We're going to do affordable today because we ain't really doing anything today. So for eye cream, Good Molecules, another brand that I enjoy using. Um, it's priced kind of like a little pricier. Well, I don't know because everybody raising their price these days. But it's about the same price category as The Ordinary. And it's kind of like the same thing, same idea, but I feel like whereas the ordinary is the straight up like acid or whatever. So like this says eye gel, whereas I have, whereas I have the, basically the same thing from the ordinary, but it's called caffeine solution, 5% EGCG. Whatever that is, but in the description it says reduces the appearance of eye contour, pigmentation, and of puffiness. So I'm pretty sure these are the same thing. This is just in its raw form, and this probably has in a few more ingredients. Let's see. This don't say what it is, yeah. They don't say what's in here, they don't have the ingredients. But that's what I believe it to be. So yeah, I say that I'm doing more affordable skincare, but I love this Dan the Clinique Dramatically Different Hydrating Jelly. If you're not new here, you know this is my ride or die. Road and die, road and die, road and die. This is my ride or die. I'm gonna stick beside her, but I'm saying more affordable, but this, I think this is like $48 for a bottle. I always get it when Ulta has their sale, and then I'm going to do my Innis Free sunscreen. But yeah, I always get the Clinique Dramatically Different. Dramatically Different? Yeah, hydrating jelly when there is a sale at Ulta, because that lowers the price of the bit. They usually have it like half off during that time, so... I'll look where it then and I'm gonna pay 24 before I pay 48. You get me. But yeah, and the Innis Free sunscreen is black girl cream, as you can see. No white cap. And I like to mix my sunscreen with my moisturizer. It just makes it easier to apply and doesn't leave like sunscreen sometimes I have this sticky feeling and after my skincare I always wash my hands because I don't like how my hands feel with all the skincare stuff on it and yeah that's today's skincare I washed my face with the Sephora Super Glow Cleansing Powder. If you guys know me, you guys know I love that. Down, it has in vitamin C and E, so it helps with brightening and toning, toning. But yeah, I've been wearing my Apple Watch all the time because we gotta get those steps and grow. We're doing 10,000 steps every day. Sometimes I just be in the house Walking up and down to meet my steps when I'm not when I'm not able to go out and do my runs. I well walk around jogs and make sure I get my steps in by walking around the house. I also placed the order to get some new running shoes, so I'm gonna go pick those up as soon as I tell them that they're ready. Let me wipe y'all off. I'd be so scared when it comes to like this camera because I don't wanna break it. Cause then I have to buy it back. And I didn't buy this one. Cause she's a little pricey. But, yeah. Anyway, let's go outside and clean up from Monday. Well, it's mostly clean. I just have to do with our inflatable pool that we have. Fun fact, I had initially bought 
the inflatable pool for my daughter, but it's a whole adult swimming pool. So I had to go in with her. It was fun. Let's go to the backyard. I have to put on shoes because I'm not going back there in my house shoes. I mean, my house shoes are dirty, but that'll make them dirtier. I gotta throw my house shoes in the wash or just buy a new pair. So let me show you. This is my office room that I'm in. Office slash guest room. This is the pool. It's from Mini Dip and it says the first designer inflatable pool. So that's what we have. I think I showed you guys them in a previous vlog where I bought the pool, the sprinkler, and a fountain. But well, we only pulled out the pool for Monday. Actually, <laughs> in fact, we have these two cheaper kiddie pools. Okay, here's one. But I turned off the camera instead of switching it around. But we bought these cheaper kiddie pools. So you can say they didn't work. That one popped. But then here's the pool. I put it upside down so that it don't collect water. And it collected water. So I'm going to deal with that. Deflate the pool. And yeah. grass is struggling to like right up by the house or else i think you guys could have seen me the grass is having a hard time but we working on that we working on that we pay someone to come and treat it every week every other week so yeah anyway let me go wash my hands get tidied up and edit until it's time to go pick up my sneakers. Then we'll hit the road. So, see you for now. What time is it? 11.15 and I felt like I got so much done. I got so much done. Anyway, see you in a bit.